As uh, Mr. George was saying, uh, it was an all, -in, and Dr. Yusuf had also said it, it was an all-encompassing speech, touching on virtually uh, everybody. Even as I noted, the infrastructure support fund for the states, um, that uh, now I recall that when you look a bit further on in the speech, he, he explains how it's for things like evacuating produce from yeah. interlands and uh, all, all yeah. that uh, yeah. kind of a thing. Um, but so by and large, the way we are now, the president appealed, he did a very personal thing. Yeah. Um, you know, that is, he, he could have put it out through one of the many, well, you know, one of the officials, but he realized that it was important. People wanted to hear from the leader. And uh, I think we've not had this for quite a long while. Mm -hmm. And um, this probably is something that is um, much to be commended. That once, now he, he, he owned it. He was talking about, look, you need to understand my decisions. Yeah, you know, yeah. the box stops here. He's taking them. However you see them, let me now explain it again. Yes, so that, that uh, interaction with the people, I think it probably has yielded. Uh, even those that used to criticize him, yeah. apart from what you uh, started off with, which <coughs> is that all of these things, we just need to be very sure that they are executed as intended. Exactly. That was the only criticism, if criticism one can mm. call it, uh, that people had. Uh, apart from that, it looks like um, maybe Nigerians have been suitably encouraged to bear a bit more with the new direction of the administration. Yeah, even from the speech, uh, you could also feel his emotions about this. You know? He spoke about this country that he loved. Exactly. You could feel his emotions. So there is no doubt that he's committed to alleviating the sufferings of the people. And he said that if there are other ways you could have achieved these things, he would have. He would have, he would have taken those ways. But yes. there are no other ways. We just have to go through it yes. for now. So what is important now is this route that he has taken. Let us, as much as possible, get stakeholders involved in all these critical intervention areas mm -hmm. so that you can get more, more results, you know, so that the outcomes can be better. Because no matter how brilliant you are as an economist or whatever, if you are delivering or putting together policies and you are not engaging people who are on ground, you know, it could affect the quality of your policy and the quality of your intervention. It definitely will. What do you think you of know? the of the, um, the uh, this, um, what is it now, the, 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 the uh, power the electricity power people saying that they want to, you know, hike their uh, rates. Well, I, I don't think that is appropriate at this time, it's, and it's also important because they've done a public application. Yes, it's, it's, it's also important to also be careful not to demonize subsidy. All over the world, subsidies are given to support the citizens. In 2022, because of the key challenges that city, I mean, people you know, face globally with regard to this energy thing, energy subsidy was about $1 trillion in 2022. Whether you are talking of US, you are talking of EU and all of that. The problem with our own version of subsidy is that it is corruption reading. Yes. And now, hopefully, they're dismantling. Dismantle uh, that and rechannel it. Yes. Because the whole essence of yes. government is to rechannel these resources, not to take it away mm -hmm. completely. No. So we need subsidy in energy, in electricity. We have to work it out. Because you need electricity to power your industries. You need electricity to create jobs. It's not a luxury. Well, it's a key infrastructure component. Dr. Yusuf, you know? we're, we're going to have to leave it here, but um, <laughs> at least um, uh, we, we are on course, it would appear. Of course, uh, of course. There's no doubt. We are, we are on course. We, we are on course here, yeah. and um, I want to thank you very much for coming in to thank you. You know, thank highlight you. those things and also emphasize some of them that needed to be emphasized. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's a pleasure. Okay.